Today I'm doing a huge grocery haul from Trader Joe's, Aldi's, and Costco. So if you'd like to see the kinds of food I eat to lose over 100 pounds on the Weight Watcher Personal Points Plan, be sure to watch this video. Hi, my name is Patty. Thanks for clicking on my channel, Winning at Weight Loss. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Today's video, I'm doing a huge reset grocery haul. I've been in Florida for about three months and I kind of maintained, I haven't been losing weight. I've been, I've had some good days and some bad days. I was there for three months, like I said. I spent a week on a cruise and you know how cruises go. And then I flew to my daughter's for a week and she is a great cook and made me all kinds of food that, including homemade lasagna and oatmeal cream cookies that I found it really hard to resist. So I've had good days along the three months and bad days. I was working at the Hard Rock. They have a an employee dining room that is kind of like a buffet for all your meals. So it's pretty tempting, but I tried to make good choices. Some days didn't always make good choices. So this is kind of a restart grocery haul. So come on along and see what I bought at Trader Joe's, Aldi's, and Costco. In today's Costco haul, I got some lightly breaded chicken breast chunks. They are four points for three ounces. These are really good in the air fryer. I got some boneless chicken breasts just to have around. I got these organic glazed vegetables. They are green and yellow zucchini, red peppers, cherry tomatoes, and asparagus. And these are two points for three quarters of a cup. I got this package of cilantro lime rice blend. It has red onions, fire roasted corn, and red bell pup peppers. And that is five points for a cup serving. The spices I got were some of this buttery steakhouse rub. It is zero calories, zero points per serving. I got a big container of garlic powder because we like our garlic here. And I had ran out and that is a good price there at Costco. We bought a package of these keto friendly hot dog buns. They are 90 calories each and two points. So they go good with my fat free hot dogs that I bought. And bananas and a bag of stir fry vegetable blend to make a stir fry with. I got a rotisserie chicken. The rotisserie chickens at Costco are huge and they're only $4.99. So I got that and the white meat is zero points and the dark meat is usually one point for an ounce or two ounces. And the last item I got was an eye of round. It's a really lean cut of beef and it is only one point per ounce. And I will roast that up in the oven. And it is a good meat to purchase. So that is my Costco haul for today. Here's my Aldi's haul for today. I mainly went to get some fruit and vegetables, but I picked up a few other things. I got a bag of onions some tilapia fillets, a bag of frozen mixed vegetables, and a bag of green beans. I got a rotisserie flavored turkey breast tenderloin. These are real good. I got some zucchini. I like to roast vegetables, so I bought zucchini and some peppers. and some broccoli and I will toss them in the air fryer with a little olive oil spray to make a tasty side dish. I also got a bag of Fuji apples. I never could find an apple I really like, but I think these are my favorite. Comment below on what your favorite kind of apples are. Some fresh strawberries, a couple of bags of carrots, 
a package of the 96% lean ground beef, some cotton candy grapes. They're expensive, but they taste good. I got a couple containers of chicken broth for recipes, package of classic coleslaw, which I might make some, uh, a recipe with uh, turkey and it's like a Asian recipe. I got my stock coffee, a bag of potatoes, an avocado, and I saw these peanut butter fudge crisp, crisp bars. These are only three points each. And then I found these chewy chocolate chip granola bars, which are four points each. And I also got some salsa to make salsa chicken. I got this kind. It is the mild chunky salsa. And then I saw the cilantro lime salsa, which sounds really good. So I bought that also. So that is my Aldi's haul for getting back on the track. Okay, this is my Trader Joe's haul. I started off, I got some of my favorite cheese. This light mozzarella cheese is only one point for a quarter cup, 60 calories. And I also got this light shredded three cheese blend of Monterey Jack, mozzarella, and cheddar cheese. And this is three points for a quarter cup. So that is for both good cheese choices at Trader Joe's. Got some 99% lean turkey breast that is ground up. That is only zero, that is zero points per serving. I got some shredded carrots to have. Um, I just, I wanted to try them shredded, see if I could make something out of them. So I got a bag of those. I got this spinach and kale Greek yogurt dip. This is only one point for two tablespoons. I also got a tomato and basil hummus dip. I never tried this one before, it sounded good. This also is one point for two tablespoons. I got this tzatziki creamy garlic cucumber dip. I was going to try to make some chicken gyros with that. So that uh, is a one point for two tablespoon option. You could also use it for dipping vegetables. I got some of these fire roasted bell peppers and onions. They're just an easy, convenient way to have the peppers and onions already cut up and ready to go. So I got some of those. I got actually two bags of those. They, sometimes they don't have them at Trader Joe's, but I really like to get these. I got some peppers. I got an orange pepper, a green, green pepper, and a red pepper. I think I'm gonna make some stuffed peppers this week. I got a package of the shred, shredded hash brown patties. These are four points for each patty. So sometimes they're good to have a change up instead of just regular shredded hash browns. I got two bags of their super sweet cut white corn, which I switched out my corn to be zero points now. So, cause it's corn is in season and I've given up my potatoes as zero points. And that is zero points. And this is a really good and super sweet. I got a box of this beef shepherd's pie. This is, really good it's five points for the entire serving which is let's see how many ounces is this it's 16 ounces it's only five points for the entire thing or three points per cup i got some tomato sauce two cans of their uh diced and fire roasted tomatoes which also i like i'm going to make a, ve a recipe um of uh American goulash. I got one of these protein and bar cookies and cream bear bells. There's a lot of different flavors. Uh, this is this one is the lowest one in points. I saw it was four points. So I bought that. I bought some of these organic carrots of uh, many colors. I had tried these at uh, my work. They had air roast or baked them and they were really tasty. So I thought I was going to try to make those and duplicate uh, the recipe, but the, the real colors are, they're colorful and I'm going to air fry them. 
I got some kettle cooked potato chips. These are 50% less, less fat than regular potato chips. They are four points for about 18 chips. So I like to have a bag of those if I want chips to go with the sandwich. And um, I got those. I also got these turkey corn dogs, which are Trader Joe's staple for me. These are five points per serving. They taste like a regular air, um, a regular corn dog. I microwave them for about 30 seconds and I throw them in the air fryer so they get nice and toasty. And those are, are excellent for five points. Bag of Brussels sprouts. I saw a recipe the other day to make them with Parmesan cheese. I think I'm gonna try to air fry those and see if I like them. I'm not usually a fan of Brussels sprouts, but I do try a different way, so I'm gonna see if I like it that way. I got a whole bag of the Cara Cara Navel oranges as a fruit choice. It's a pink orange, and they are seedless and good to have around. I got a can of the traditional fat-free refried beans. These are zero points. I like Trader Joe's, they're chunky, they have the chunky beans in them, so if you need them for anything, I like this brand. I'm trying this beef chomp. This is like a smoky or whatever. It's three points for the serving. It has nine grams of protein and 90 calories, zero sugar. So I never tried these before, but I am trying one now. I got a couple of new spices. I got this cheesy seasoning blend. I've never seen this at Trader Joe's before. You could, it says you could use it on vegetables, popcorn, pasta, so I'm trying that. And then I also got a onion salt, which I use on a lot of different items. It's one of my favorite spices that Trader Joe's has. I got a box of the Everything But the Bagel Seasoned Crackers. These are four points for 16 crackers, and they would be good with any of those dips make a nice little snack and I had two pounds of the extra lean ground beef this is one point for one ounce so if I want to use any uh, be this if I want to make anything with beef this is what I use a 96% lean beef I got a bag of this shiitake mushroom chicken to have this is two points for one cup serving I've had this before. It's really good. Serve it over some rice and you have yourself an easy, quick meal. Then I got a bag of Italian macaroni for my uh, American goulash I am going to be making. And then another favorite at Trader Joe's I like are the chicken sausages. I'm trying this roasted garlic. The, they're only three points per link. This would be good with the peppers and onions that I had bought in. Also like the sweet Italian chicken sausage, also three points per link. So those two kinds of sausages are my one of my favorites to get in the chicken sausage variety. And I think that about wraps up my Trader Joe's haul to get going on a healthy lifestyle again, get my healthy habits back in order. So please comment below on what your favorite store to shop at for your Weight Watcher, Healthy Foods, or whatever program you're on. And if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified of every time I upload a new video. Remember, we're here to eat healthy, get fit, and be well. This is Patty, and I'm winning at weight loss. Thanks so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!